Hi children, uh, this is Chinmay Sir here. Now today I am discussing about the utility programs. So children, before know that utility, what is utility software? First of all, we know that what is utility. Utility means a service provided for the user. User means we are the users. The some services are provided as a utility program. So what do you mean by utility software? Now utility software perform a specific task in a computer system. A software perform a specific task to managing our computer system. To managing our computer system means it is a input and output device and many more devices are there to working in a computer system. So utility software also provide the smooth functionality of a computer system. <coughs> now example of a uh, utility software are antivirus, backup, disk repair, file management, computer network etc. Now in this uh, in these utility programs, first of all, now we want to discuss utility, network utility, scanning, file manager, backup, disk management, and compression. Now, go to the one by one. Now, what do we mean by network utility? Network utility is the software utility programs that are provides the network connectivity that are provides a network connectivity speed and performance. Now, next one is a file manager. In this file manager. You have already discussed the copy, move, and cut. Already we have discussed in the class standard four. What do you mean by file manager? File management is a program that are responsible for it is responsible for copy, delete, move, and the file it manage it file and folder. Now next one, disk management. In this disk management, it is a utility program. So what do you mean by disk? Disk means it's a like your computer hard disk or any other hard drive suppose in a disk management it enable the user to manage the disk drive it can it can be used to partition of the drives and format drives etc it can suppose i take one hard disk suppose you want to take a hard disk computer systems so in this hard disk we make a different partition we make a different different partition this partition a drive e drive d drive yes or no this type of the this is a called a partition now what do you format format means the one functionality are available for our hard disk or any other drive suppose the hard disk have a full the data is full or i want to erase the all the data of the hard disk i want to erase all the data of hard disk so that's how we are go for a format we are go for the format if once you will do the formatting once you will do the format the all the data will be erased from your hard disk now go to the next one what is scanning scanning is the also utility programs so in this utility software checking for the computer systems driver files or any other drivers for possible virus or malware attack is known as scanning best of all it is the important point what is a scanning remember very carefully now act of checking the computer system driver or files or possible virus or malware attack to known as scanning scanning is done by a antivirus utility so anti what do you mean by the antivirus utility it provides the protection of our computer system against the virus uh, virus attacks uh, now what is the example of antivirus software that are the example of quickkill abbas ABG is the most popular antivirus software there. Now next point is the next one is utility program is backup. Backup is the one most familiar utility program in our computer systems. So in this process, the backup process is providing recovering the data in case of damage or accidentally loss maybe in your hard disk span suppose uh, some data is there or you are storing the some data the hard disks are not working or the drive are not so so in this process you want to backup the all the data means backup means recovering the data in case of damage or accidentally loss now what is the process of how to do the backup utility program how to set the backup utility program in our computer systems so so first of all you go to the start menu and then go to the control panel go to the start menu then go to your control panel now click on the backup and restore options in this restore option the click on setup the backup option will be available once you click on ok or proceed the backup utility program will be work 
now next one is the compression compression means the process of shrink the files suppose i want to take the one example suppose the less disk space is there less disk space is occurred in our computer system if we are the next uh, next function next one is if we are sending a file or email attachment so we need the compress the files so we need the compress the files compress the files the compress file cannot be read directly suppose here i have mentioned shrink the files means file are in bigger size file are in bigger size suppose less disk space is occurred if we are sending the file on a email attachment so we need the compress of the files so the compress file cannot be read directly we must decompress the file to their actual form then we will use the next one is a language processor then we want to use a language processor so what do we mean by a language processor children very carefully listen in that a language processor is a special type of computer software what do you mean a language processor a language processor this is a very important point language processor is a special type of computer software that has capacity to translate the source code or program code into a machine code suppose we want to take a one example suppose we want to write something suppose my name is chinmay that computer cannot be understand the computer can translate it in that the translating process who is done by the translating process na language processor so what what is your work for a language processor na language processor is a special type of computer software that has capacity to translate the source code source code means whatever i am writing or whatever you are writing right children hope you are understand translate the source code or program code into a machine code suppose i want to briefly example over here software are created by writing a different language like a uh, c c++ java and uh, like a c c like java c c++ you are writing and their computer are understand done only a machine language you are writing this programs and computer are understand by a machine language that is a zeros s and one s form that is the binary form the computer understand only a machine code the computer cannot understand the simple english language so first of all the computer language processor language processor means is a translator in this translator the uh, the whatever your language are writing that are converted into a machine code because it is a machine understandable format now language process play a vital role in translating the programming language into a machine language children very important point now language process plays a vital role in translating the programming language into a machine language now here the translator how many types of translator na basically it's a three type of translator assembler compiler and interpreter that is a three type of translator are there to converting the simply english language or simply language to machine code what does it mean what do you mean by assembler important points are there it converts the whatever you want to write the code it converts the code written into assembly language into a machine language sorry then compiler it convert the whole program whatever you write the whole program c program or java program whatever you are writing the all the program it converted the whole program into a equivalent to machine code their interpreter what is the interpreter work it translate the program code it translate the program code line by line each here here it is the all the program you want to convert here all the program you want to convert now here interpreter in a interpreter this is a one line first line uh, first line second line third line fourth line the interpreter convert the each and every line okay the program code line by line it translate the program code line by line if the error is found in a second number if error is found in a second number program will be stop if when we will rectify this error then program move to the next line that's the interpreter working now go to the next one now here we want to discuss application software now we want to discuss a 
application software these are what do you mean by the application software these are the set of program these are set of program developed by a programmer developed by a programmer in order to perform a specific task for user suppose i am the user i want to do the i want to require the tally software to accounting for my accounting purpose for my factory accounting purpose so in this i have the special program i want to require so it is the application program so it is a application program suppose i am to writing some letter so i want to need a microsoft word that is also a application program these are the set of program developed by the programmer programmer in order to perform a specific task children you have to confuse about the word what do you mean by the programmer programmer means those are experienced in a programming language those are experienced in a programming language and these are most uh, that is called like those are know that like a software engineer or phd or mtech those are the qualified in the computer programmer they are doing the programming they are doing the programming so those are the programmer are called a programmer so in order to perform a specific task for a user some example of general purpose application software are word processing software electronic press software database management software presentation software desktop publishing software graphic software and multiple multimedia software now next video we will discuss in all that application softwares so thank you children move to the next video